Hey everyone, today is still Sunday, March 1st, 2015. This is still Zero Labs and I'm still Mark Brash, your host. Uh, the video clips of the wiring that you're about to see now were recorded on February 8th, 2015. The mechanical assembly that you just saw was recorded on February 7th, 2015. Incidentally, the, uh, the, that video ran in that recording the, the amount of time it took me to build on the 7th, I was up until 2 a.m. that night putting the mechan mechanics of the printer together and I was up till beyond midnight on the 8th finishing up all of the wiring. So without further ado, here's the wiring. So, that was easy. Do you think? I don't. <laughs> no, that was not easy at all. Um, for those of you who are thinking about purchasing one of these kits, I can tell you for a fact it is not for your average consumer. You have to be a very good builder in order to successfully put one of these things together and get it to work correctly. Um, in my final review, We'll talk about the various details and various roadblocks that I ran into, uh, all of the things that I had to learn in order to uh, get this thing up and running, uh, get it, you know, all the mechanics adjusted, get the software, the proper firmware loaded onto the main controller board, the calibration procedures, all of the headaches involved. Uh, 
it was it was it was a challenge, for sure. Um, it is promoted as a uh, as a kit, but you know, <laughs> th there are certain problems with this kit that uh, you really need to be aware of. And hopefully, if you still decide to go ahead and purchase one of these kits off of eBay, hopefully after watching these videos, the assembly process will go a little smoother for you. Thank you all for watching. As always, please rate, share, comment, and subscribe. And peace, everyone.